How's it going? Travis Kanong here, back at my home mountain, Palisades Tahoe. Fired up for the Stiefel Palisades Tahoe Cup, coming back to town this weekend. Um, let's go check out the hill. We're at the top of Snow King Mountain. Um, behind me is the, the race hill, and uh, it's really cool how they built this start up on this mound here on the top of Snow King. We have Alpine Meadows on this side, Olympic Valley on this side, and Lake Tahoe directly behind us. And uh, it's a really special start for me personally because I grew up right on the backside of Snow King Peak and Alpine Meadows, and, and this is my home. Here I am at the start. Um, there's only one flat section on the entire hill, and it's just after the start. So they built up this amazing start mound up above the red dog chair. And so it's gonna be critical for the guys who were gonna win the race to push like crazy out of the start to carry their speed across this top flat. And to make it a little more interesting, the, the crew here at Palisades built some rollers and a little double feature um, coming onto the flat. Here we go, let's check it out. So after the top flat and the start, the real hill begins. This is called upper dog leg, and it gets really, really steep here. I think uh, the race director was saying there's a 55 degree pitch off of this roll right here. And it's it's pretty in your face all the way to the finish from here, never ending. And, and uh, really cool how they built the course on the skier's left-hand side of dog leg, where it's a little steeper pitches and a little bit more in your face. And um, it's gonna be amazing to watch the guys kind of send it into this section after navigating the top flat. So here we are below the rollers and uh, after these rollers you pick up a lot of speed and you come into this side hill section where it's going to be so important to have these quick switches left to right and the right footer is going to be super heavy uh, with the hill kind of just pulling you out to the to the woods. Um, super high speeds in this section and you're going to have to kind of keep that speed in check to keep the tempo going and not miss a gate and uh, I mean for sure pushing through this section but skiing smart, skiing tactical and it's a tough, tough hill here so um, this is the meat of it. This last section, it really opens up into this wide face here and it's super steep all the way into the finish. And so um, one side of it, as a spectator, it's gonna be amazing to watch the action down here. There's not a lot of venues that end right at the base, right in the village um, and venues where you can actually see a majority of the race from the bottom. So um, for spectators, it's gonna be absolutely amazing. Um, for the racers, it's a little different. As soon as you come around those rolls and drop into this last pitch, you see the finish just straight down below you. and Sometimes when, when you get close to the finish, it's really hard to stay focused and really keep working on the skiing. And, and uh, it's gonna be important for them not to lose their focus and to uh, keep pushing on the skis and keeping your elevation all the way here into the finish. Good luck to all the competitors. Um, I wish I was racing with you guys, but at the same time, I'm really happy I'm not. Uh, this hill is gonna be super challenging. It's gonna be a great show and uh, I'm fired up to show the world my home mountain, Palisades Tahoe.